Plus brings to you DI Grow, organic plus foliar fertilizers and biopesticides for the improvement of both macro and micro soil nutrients, depression of soil borne diseases, quick root development and growth, robust vegetative growth, enhanced flowering and fruiting, control of fall armyworms, tuta absoluta, and many other important pests, 70% productivity. High income from sustainable yields able to cover average costs per hectare. For more details, visit Dynalab International Zambia Limited at plot number. Good afternoon and welcome to the Perfect Health Show brought to you by Dynalab International Zambia Limited. And well, we hope you're enjoying your Thursday afternoon as much as we are. All right, so today I'm joined by Dora, no stranger to the show. Good afternoon, Dora. I hope. How are you doing today? Fine, how have you been? Uh, the last day I saw you was, when was that? Um, just the other day. No, it was Monday. <laughs> <laughs> so how have you been? Looking good. I love no, the hair. thank you. You're looking awesome as well, <laughs> as usual. You. Thank you. I love the blue. Oh, oh, we're all in blue right now. Yes. <laughs> Dr. John, I'm so happy to see you as well. It's my pleasure too to see you. Yeah, so Dr. John is featuring on the show uh, for the very first time today, but we'll be seeing more of him um, in the many shows to come. How have you been, Dr. John? I've been fine, and you ladies are looking gorgeous. Where have you been? What have you been up to? I've uh, been up and down trying to think uh, how we don't get mental problems because of COVID. Oh, uh, and that's encouraging great. people that uh, through Dynafarm products we can change the story. Mm -hmm. And for sure, we've seen uh, that Dynafarm members who are committed, mm -hmm. they haven't lost a lot in terms of income, in terms of uh, lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And uh, we haven't lost quite, uh, a lot of people due to COVID, especially those who have been consistent on the mm -hmm. product. Mm -hmm. Majority of them have recovered very quickly. Mm -hmm. And uh, I want to encourage people out there, if you still uh, are fearing COVID, have your nutmeg, do the steaming, uh, take your noni, take your spirulina, and uh, vitamin C, and life becomes much better for you. Great. Mm. All right, so today on the show, we are focusing on healthy water with Dynalab Water yes. Mineral Report. And Dr. John and uh, Dora are here to explain to us, you know, what this healthy water mm -hmm. is all about yes. and just, just more info on it. So mm -hmm. what are the health benefits of drinking water? I think let's start with that. Yeah. Okay, uh, real quick, we chose to talk about this topic, about healthy water and specifically our water mineral report today because um, recently the Ministry of Health announced that there's actually an outbreak of typhoid oh, yeah. okay, in Lusaka and surrounding areas and as we know typhoid is a waterborne disease mm -hmm. so it's very important for people to be um, very conscious about the type of water and the quality of water that they're taking mm -hmm. now when it comes to benefits of water as we all know water is life okay we can survive you know a few days maybe a bit longer we can even go up to a month without food okay but it like takes water water is an essential part of everyday life uh, water helps to carry nutrients as well as oxygen to the relevant areas of the body it flushes out bacteria okay it helps to regulate body temperature control your blood pressure you know it just helps you to function on a daily basis mm -hmm. and I get really really surprised when people you ask somebody and say how much water have you had today and they tell you um, I haven't had any uh, I haven't had any water, well, I don't or, know. or I don't know, mm. or I, I drink had, when I feel this. <laughs> <laughs> I drink when I feel thirsty, which is wrong, because you know what really happens when you're feeling the thirst? It's like your body is literally screaming to you, just to tell you, to say, okay, come on, can we get a little something? We're getting into a level of dehydration. Mm. So people should really not wait until they feel thirsty for them to take water, because as you can see, without water, it's also excellent for skin. Mm -hmm. By the way, mm -hmm. you know, it flushes out impurities, it helps with the digestive system. Yeah, I guess it, it explains why your skin looks so good. Well, we try our very <laughs> best to drink alkaline water from the mineral pot on a daily basis. So mm -hmm. um, I think it's really important for people to make the consumption of water a lifestyle. A lifestyle, yeah. Yes. You shouldn't wait, like I said. And another thing is people take water with their meals which is actually quite wrong because what you do when you're taking, you know, you have your shimmer and you have your water, a glass of water, which is a very typical Zambian culture. Well, you know? I do that. Yeah. But That's see, wrong. That can, in the long run, can cause you digestive disorders because when you're taking water and you're taking food, you're actually uh, diluting the digestive enzymes that are supposed to help you with the absorption and digestion of your food. Mm. So you need to give it a bit of time, okay, so that um, you're able to break down the food, let all the nutrients go where they were supposed to go before you take your water instead of flushing them all out. We are learning. Yeah. <laughs> so Dr. John, how much water is needed daily? Uh, approximately everybody should have 
two returns and above. Anything less than two returns would be not sufficient for the body. Mm-hmm. But considering like now the climate is very bad and maybe we are eating a lot of foods with a lot of salt, a lot of chemicals, so the need for water in the body increases as the bad diet increases. Mm-hmm. So the question is, how much bad food are people eating out there? What is the loss? How, how many soft drinks people are drinking out there? Mm-hmm. How will you get the, rid of them from the system? Yeah. Either you'll tap into your body saving of mm-hmm. the water uh, and therefore you'll find you'll suffer diseases mm-hmm. if the water is insufficient. So people should have at least two liters and above of very clean water, not just water. Mm-hmm. There's something very important that I would want to clarify, that people can drink water, but it is not clean. Mm-hmm. You drink water that will need the body to clean it first yes. before it becomes useful. Mm-hmm. And therefore the question is then why did you drink water that will cost the body mm-hmm. to maintain it? So it becomes expensive. And that's why we want to insist that it's two liters of pure mm-hmm. clean water. Yes. Mm-hmm. So what is considered Dora as clean healthy water? Okay, so clean healthy water is basically what John has said. Water that is going to be beneficial to your body system. Okay, so this is water that does not contain any foreign particles or any kind of bacteria. Um, at the beginning, we mentioned that there's an outbreak of typhoid, and this is because bacteria is now um, settling into the water, which is stagnant, it's not moving. Mm. So, it's always good to have um, a source of water that is flowing, okay, because that lessens the amount of bacteria that is constantly flowing. Try and avoid keeping water in buckets and things because that can actually harbor and um, begin to accumulate some bacteria. So clean, healthy, safe water is water that has um, uh, no impurities in it, okay, and also has a certain pH balance. All right. So when you talk about a pH balance, um, when you look at the pH scale, we have acid and then we have alkaline. I don't know if you remember <laughs> your whoa, science whoa. from school. <laughs> don't even go there. <laughs> So most of the water that we're drinking or we're keeping in our boreholes, in our, our mineral pots, or and not this mineral pot, but in our pots at home, um, has quite an acidic sort of pH, all right? Now, when you're consuming that water, it comes back to what John has said about negative or dirty kind of water, which is not good for you. Because then the body has to alkalize that water and able for you to now consume it effectively. So that means the water is costing the body. Yes. Mm-hmm. Instead of the body maintaining you, mm-hmm. you're uh, now it is now doing filtering. a job of maintaining the water that you drank. Yes. Mm. And then sickness and disease actually thrive in an acidic environment. So if you're keeping your body acidic and you're not taking the right type of water to alkalize your system, you're making yourself more prone to getting sick from all these funny diseases. Bear in mind right now we're in the hot, so-called hot season or summer season or rain season where we have typhoid, we have dysentery, we have cholera. So it's very important to make sure that the water that you're taking is clean, safe and healthy. So when I just wake up in the morning, I brush my teeth, I drink mm-hmm. water. Yeah, or alternatively, yeah. Like, like Dora said, you can survive without food, but mm-hmm. you can't survive without yeah. food. So, uh, but people have given eating much priority, mm-hmm. and they overeat actually. So uh, they don't measure the calories they take, and therefore you find they take a lot of calories mm-hmm. and very little pure water. Mm-hmm. So the body suffers the deficiencies, and that is how sickness starts. Actually. Yeah. So the more water you drink, the better for you. If you can drink it even every hour. The better for mm-hmm. Great. Now let's talk about the Dynalab um, mineral pot. Uh, what are the benefits of having one um, in the house or office? Mm-hmm. I, I want to say that uh, the question is how can you guarantee that the water you're drinking is pure? Mm-hmm. I, uh, considering that uh, we have different sources of water, mm-hmm. uh, we encourage people to have mineral pot because it gives you a guarantee that the water you're taking has, like uh, my uh, colleague has said, the correct pH. Mm-hmm. The pH is very vital. Once you disturb your pH, the system will not work normally. So our mineral pot first of all balances the pH of the water to make okay. sure that it's in line with your body. So when it comes to the body, the moment you just drink it and swallow it, mm-hmm. immediately it you starts feel the functioning. Benefit. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. And two, because uh, she said about acidic system, this water that has the right pH when uh, you use our mineral uh, pot uh, means that immediately you drink it, it will go and try to clean out the excessive acids that are in the system. Mm. And uh, these excessive acids, even if they don't cause diseases directly, they do ap- affect the performance of the cells. So when the pH is abnormal, the cells will kind of sleep until the pH is back to normal, then they start functioning. So that means when you drink the mineral pot water, water from our mineral pot, mm. your body is functioning every minute. There's no time that the pH is bad. Mm. And uh, number three is remineralization of the water. You can drink water that is just 
uh, HO2. But it, real quality water should have minerals, and, vit and uh, those minerals, some of them are very important. So our mineral port for Dynafarm adds back the nutrients, or rather the minerals that are supposed to be in water. Therefore, some of these minerals you can't find them even in food, mm -hmm. but uh, you can resupply them to the system uh, uh, through the water. Uh, some things like nails, they require things like silica. Uh, very rarely would you find a food with silica yeah, or even a, a supplementation mm -hmm. of silica, but you can find it in clean, natural water that has been uh, yes. uh, passed so through the water system. Mm. And you'll find your nails are growing nicely, your skin is growing nicely yes. because of that. There's also the aspect of uh, what we, uh, she said about germs. And uh, our mineral pot water doesn't care where did the water come from. Mm -hmm. It can simply not allow any impurity to pass through it because it, uh, the, the upper part of the mineral part mm -hmm. pot sucks the water and the holes are so tiny, 0 0.01 micron, mm -hmm. therefore there is no bacteria, virus or that any chemical or, or that can pass through. I feel healthy already. And, <laughs> and, and down there also there is something that uh, helps uh, to, to, uh, to make sure that this water is not, uh, if, if it was from a, an area where you find sometimes the, there is hard water, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, it is able to put that water to remove the hardness of the water. Therefore, when you drink even just a grass, you are satisfied. Sometimes yes. you can drink water and you still feel uh, your body is still not yeah. working well. There are people who say, no, I drink sufficient water, mm -hmm. but uh, my urine is still yellow. I drink enough water, but my, my skin is not becoming mm -hmm. better. It's because maybe that water is not pure enough. So okay. our mineral report ensures that the water quality is extremely high and it's available. The good thing about it also is that um, it, it is uh, contamination free, meaning it, if you put or rather when you're filtering the water, there's no way uh, it can be contaminated again. Mm. So you find some people they have a water system where for drinking, yeah. but before, after it is filtered, when it's coming, it can it's get contaminated. Yes. Yes. So this system ensures that uh, it doesn't happen. Yeah. And the other good thing is that once you buy it, it can stay for almost a year mm -hmm. or, or more. Okay. Yeah, depending on the quality of the water that you use. Okay. For people who are sick, quality water becomes essential, very essential, and those who are aging. And therefore, taking uh, water from our mineral pot ensures that you will regain your health back quickly. And especially even for those who are on medication, mm -hmm. you need water that is clean that can help wash out yes. that uh, waste quickly. Mm -hmm. For those people who like enjoying their life, they eat junk, mm -hmm. they drink, whatever they Don't love. Don't we all? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they need to use a lot of uh, pure water so that whatever they drank or ate yesterday mm -hmm. will be washed out nicely and quickly, as, as quickly as possible, so that we avoid the backlog. Yes. So the benefits of this mineral water is that one, it keeps your health optimal, mm -hmm. two, it supplies back the nutrients that you need, mm -hmm. and three, it makes sure that no diseases, pathogens, bacteria, viruses, uh, and so forth that can be found mm -hmm. through, through the water you're drinking. And number four, it makes sure that your body gets the right quality uh, pH water. Mm. And you know another good thing about this? It does not require any electricity at all. Okay. So you just set it up and you mount it, whether it's in your office, it's in your kitchen, you know you have relatives in the village, at the farm, you just take it there, you get your water from wherever you're putting it through and you put it there and you're going to have your natural spring mineral water. Lovely. All right, so are there another, um, other products from Dynalab that can help prevent or treat conditions such as typhoid? Okay, um, at Dynalab we have quite a number of products that help prevent um, or treat uh, conditions like typhoid, diarrhea, cholera and all that uh, with the focus being on the gut or the digestive system. Mm. So for one we have something that we call the Total Health Pack, yeah. okay, which encompasses the whole body as it, it says, you know. Um, total Health. Total Health, alright. We have a probiotic that we have that balances out the flora. You know, we have good and bad bacteria okay in the system which is necessary even the bad bacteria that we have is quite necessary but then there must be a balance of the good and as well as the bad okay there we'll need like <laughs> a whole day for you to explain yes, that so we'll go to that another time <laughs> let, let me say let me say this that um, uh, those people especially who want to stay healthy mm -hmm. they need first of all to watch how how does this microorganism survive? Mm -hmm. Because you eat food that has all water that was contaminated mm -hmm. and yes. it went to the stomach. Yeah. Yeah. And the first thing that happens when you swallow food is that the acid in the stomach mm -hmm. is supposed to kill yes. all pathogens that are in the food. Mm -hmm. So the very fact that people sometimes are drinking uh, dirty water means mm -hmm. that uh, uh, and they are not drinking sufficient water mm. means that the system itself has been disfranchised. Yes. And therefore, we want to put back the system to its yes. conducive environment. Because
because originally human beings were not supposed to be treated they were supposed to be self sufficient self contained mm. they have their system able to measure and control diseases i like that the body is self contained mm. yes I so like that. these uh, mineral water and uh, most of our products that we have here mm -hmm. are able to ensure that your body has been given back its democracy Mm -hmm. democratic rights <laughs> okay. to stay without diseases. Mm -hmm. It is not right that human beings have accepted we must get sick every time. Yeah. And that mm -hmm. sickness is part and portion of our lives. Sickness uh, and disease must not be in our lives. Mm -hmm. But it can only happen if we do not destroy what God created in us. And that is a perfect system. Mm -hmm. So, and this perfect system if we are going to get it back, we must supply what we stole from the body. What did we steal from the body? Number one, we made it a dump site. We do not care what we eat, we do not care what we think, we do not care the amount of stress. We put everything inside there. So we must do a thorough detox to remove all these poisons that we have put in our system. Feeling guilty right now. You should have seen I what I was, what was having for breakfast. Before we came. So, <laughs> and, and I like the guilt part because many people, they, they want the doctor to say, what yeah. can I do to get sick? But it's simple. Just simply stop being a dustbin. Yeah. Mm. And number two, uh, put back the fuel of the body, which is mm -hmm. the vitamins and the minerals. I'm sure hope you know what you drank in the morning mm -hmm. and you, what you'll eat for lunch. Um, I know you love tasty food. The question is, is that tasty food quality enough yes. to maintain your cells? The answer is no. Cells mm -hmm. are maintained by nutrients and minerals. Yeah. How many have you put back to your system today? Okay, stop it, doctor. Stop it. So we are sorry for those who are listening. They shouldn't feel guilty. I feel like apologizing to yeah, my body right now. Body. Yeah, I'm actually sorry. you can apologize because you can I swallow yeah. urina, mm -hmm. you can swallow goat's milk. It's oh, the easiest yeah. way of... I will that. definitely do that. Yeah. 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 Okay. And, and lastly, I want to uh, encourage people mm -hmm. that as, as long as we focus on treating the diseases mm. and not prevention, the game is not over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It will still be yeah. We won against COVID better. through prevention. Yes, Why prevention. don't we win against diabetes through prevention? Yeah. We put masks for COVID. Why don't we put something like ganodema which can be able to ensure that our pancreas doesn't get spoiled mm -hmm. i like that yeah. thank you yes. thanks for that lecture <laughs> i enjoyed it all right so we're coming to the end of the show but before mm -hmm. i let you go Dina Lab, I know you are well, you know, spread out in terms yes. of, you know, where to find you, not only in Osaka, but Zambia as a whole. So just yeah. give out that information, contact details mm -hmm. if someone more, needs more information on the mineral pot as well. Yeah. So, yeah. So this water mineral pot can be found in all of our stores okay. um, across the country. Like I always put an emphasis, you can also access our products, not just through our stores, but through our very many uh, capable, wonderful distributors that are found across the country. Mm -hmm. um, so um, in Lusaka, we have two along Kafir Road, of course, which is Paneli and downtown. We have the uh, right here where we are, which is mm -hmm. head office, Rhodes Park, Joseph Mungo Road. We are along Cairo Road at Linda Moore. We are at Arcades, our newly launched shop. I actually encourage everybody to visit it. It's a very beautiful shop, well stocked at Lower Nicker Mall. And of course, we're along the line of rail. Okay, mm. I like that. Like Livingston. I think we need to go and do a show from each shop. Yeah. <laughs> Moving Might forward so well. that we can actually even meet the people and the distributors and mm. our clients in all of these shops. So we have Livingston, we have Choma and Monze, mm. we have Kabwe and Dola, Kitwe, Solwezi, Mansa, Kasama. Oh, it's everywhere. It's everywhere you go. Okay, we're in Chipata, the down shops, as well as the new mall. Uh, and then, of course, we're in Mumba. You can contact us through our different outlets or you can call 0960 610197. All right. And as well as Facebook, of course. Yeah, Facebook, on, which on is my putting shot, I would yeah. want to tell people that uh, it's uh, another next farming season is coming. It mm -hmm. is. We can also kill our soil if we want, yeah. or we can decide to use Dina Farm DI Grow, yes. which is organic fertilizer that ensures. The food quality is high mm -hmm. and your farm and soil is Very better true. and yeah. more production is achieved organically. Yes. All right. God bless you, listeners, and God bless you, ladies. Thank ah, you so job. much for coming through. I really enjoyed today's Very show. Positive. Yeah, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did today. Yeah. So, Dora, mm -hmm. Dr. John, thank you so much for coming through today. No, thank you. All right, so that's all we had for today. This has been The Perfect Health Show.